Today I'm going to show you how to record audio over an audio clip in a video clip in Adobe Premiere Pro. So the first thing I'm going to do, I have a clip here and when you listen to it, now the egret is walking. Now the egret is walking. You hear a background noise there. So I would like to record over that so that it's a clearer, crisper sound and I'm going to get rid of that background noise altogether. So what I'm going to do here, I'm going to go to my audio track mixer. Before I go on, I would like to show you how to make sure that your audio track mixer is actually showing. If you open a video sequence and your audio track mixer is not actually showing, then what you would like to do here is go to my window menu, go to audio track mixer, or click shift six and you select audio track mixer and there it is it's showing that's the tool that you need to use in order to record audio over your video clip the second thing i want to show you is a preference how to set a preference to mute the audio that's coming out of your recording as you're recording so that you don't have a conflict with listening to your recording at the same time as you are speaking. You go first to the edit menu and then you click preferences and under preferences you select audio. Notice how a new dialogue appears, the preferences dialogue appears on the audio section of that dialogue. If you appeared in another with another node selected you can always go back to the audio node here. And do you see there is an option here called mute input during timeline recording. That is the exact option that I want to select. So I'm going to select that. And when I select mute input during timeline recording, I don't have to listen to the audio feedback from the recorded audio as I'm speaking when I'm recording, which I might find confusing. After selecting the option, click OK. If for some reason you needed to hear the audio you're speaking as you're recording, you can always go back to that option and clear it. Okay, let's return to our project of recording an audio clip over a video sequence in Adobe Premiere Pro. So now that we have our audio track mixer visible, I'm going to focus on, since I have my video audio track is on A1, I'm going to focus on audio A2. And so I'm going to man audio A2 for recording. I enable that for recording by clicking the R here. At the same time, I'm going to click the record button here to enable that for recording. You see the blue circle around the record button. Everything's set up. Except one more thing, I want to mute the audio track from my video track. So I'm going to click mute here. If I click mute here or I clicked it here, either way, it's going to mute. And so that way I don't have to listen to the audio track from the video as I'm recording because that is my own preference that I don't want to do that. Now that my audio track mixer is armed to record, I've pressed the record button. The only thing I need to do here is I need to move my cursor to where I want to record. That's very important because I want my recording to start at that time point. I'm going to be recording on track two. Note that if you set an end point for your video sequence, your recording will start there, no matter where your cursor is. So coming back to the task at hand, the words I need to record are, now the egret is walking. So all I need to do is press the play button and then speak. Now the egret is walking and you will see the recording take place. Here we go. Now the egret is walking. If I stretch out this audio track, you can see that the audio sequence that I recorded is a little bit longer than the original one. You can either re-record if you're worried about that. In this case, I'm not so worried about it. I can actually shorten the audio track like that if I'd like. And eventually, I can slip it right up 
into the original video audio track if I'd like to. So now I'm just going to play it for you by just playing right now. Now the egret is walking. And you hear it nice, clear, crisp audio, which is what I wanted. And then I can just slip it right in there. Into the audio track for the video sequence. So to review here, I will actually do this again for you. But when you want to record the audio, you open your audio track mixer. You set up your track for recording. In this case, I'm doing track two. You click the record button here. And when you start the recording, you hit the play button. And you can either hit the space bar to stop the recording, or you can hit the stop button. I'm going to do that once more for the next audio string, which, as you can hear, is doing the egret walk. Doing the egret walk. I might want to put it right here as my start time. I'm going to set my record. I can mute this track. And I'm going to say doing the egret walk. So here we go. We're recording. Doing the egret walk. Now I have it. Exactly what I want where I want it, I've done my audio, I can do my editing. I'm ready to continue editing my audio on my video. We can, we can play it back just for you. Doing the egret walk. There we go. So now you know how to record audio, correct audio that you're working with if you have noisy audio and you want to re-record quickly in your video. I use a headset that has a microphone and I just plug it into my speaker outlet in my computer. It's very simple. That's about all. Enjoy.